So, you're looking for a high quality record player for the holiday season, but you don't know what to get. Well today, I'm going to help you out. Hey friends, welcome back to Vinylize. I am Jarrett New, and today I'm going to share with you all my top five record players or turntables for the holiday shopping season of 2018. And I'm also going to tell you the amplifiers and speakers you can pair them with. That way you have everything you need for your vinyl setup to work properly. And if you want to check out all of these items for yourself, the links will be available in the video description down below. Also, as a side note, this video is more for beginners who are just starting their record collecting journey, but hopefully those of you guys who've been watching my videos for a little while will also find this information helpful. Now, real quick, I just wanted to say if this is your first time here and you want to continue the journey and learn even more about record players, audio gear, and basically everything vinyl related, be sure to hit that subscribe button and bell notification so you won't miss out on the new videos. All right, now let's talk turntables. Number five, the Audio-Technica LP60. Now this is a great beginner's turntable around a hundred bucks that I've often mentioned on this channel. And at this point, you guys are probably sick of hearing me talk about it. But the fact is that this is a nice little turntable and probably the cheapest that you'd want to go. It has a built-in preamp, which is convenient, and it plays records at 33 and 45 RPM. The needle isn't the best, but it's pretty good if you're just starting out, and most importantly, it won't damage your records, unlike other brands, which we won't mention. Now, you can get the LP60 in either black or silver, and if you're looking to save money, you can also pair it with some active speakers, like the Mica PB42Xs. Those have the amplifier built inside, so that way you won't need to buy one of those separately. So, that's pretty cool. Now, finally, the last thing you're going to need to pick up is some 16-gauge speaker wire. And then after that, you hook it up, and you're good to go. Number four, the Audio-Technica LP120. Now, if you want better build quality, you can go with my personal favorite, the Audio-Technica LP120, which is around $300. And that's the turntable that you guys always see in the background of my videos. I really love this turntable, and that's why I'm always talking about it. First of all, it weighs about 23 pounds and is built like a tank. It can do three speeds, 33, 45, and 78 RPM. So that's gonna be helpful if you're looking to pick up those older shellac records. And finally, you can upgrade the various parts like the cartridge, the mat, the counterweight, and also the head shell. So it's a very customizable turntable. And if you do decide to get it, it's gonna last you many, many years. Now, in my personal setup, I paired it with the Yamaha RS201 receiver, which they've stopped making, but its successor, the RS202, is just as good, and it also has Bluetooth, so you can play music off your phone. And finally, I added the Klipsch RP150M passive speakers to my receiver, and it really is a winning combination. My setup sounds fantastic. Number three, the Fluence RT81. I had a chance to review this turntable last year, and I was pretty impressed with what I saw and heard. It's priced at 250 bucks, and for what you're getting, I'd say that's a pretty good value. First of all, the turntable comes with the cartridge and stylus pre-aligned, which is awesome because as I've said before, that's one of the most frustrating parts of the setup process. So if you go with that one, you won't have to worry about that. Now it spins at 33 and 45 RPM, has a glossy walnut finish, has a built-in preamp, and most importantly, its sound quality is very nice. But if you really want to make it shine, I would recommend pairing it with the Klipsch R15PMs, which are also active speakers with built-in amplifiers. They sound amazing, and you're going to absolutely love that setup. Number two, the U-Turn Orbit Plus. Now, this is another turntable I've mentioned in many 
many videos, and the main thing I like about the U-turn orbits is how user-friendly they are. They're about 380 bucks, and basically you can choose between green, black, blue, white, or red, and if you go with the Plus model, it has the built-in preamp, so you won't need to buy one of those separately, and that saves you money. Now, I say that the U-turn orbits are user-friendly because just like the Fluence RT81, the orbit also comes with its cartridge and stylus pre-aligned, so you don't need to worry about that. It's also a belt-driven turntable, which should cut down on the rumble and make your sound even better. And last of all, it spins at 33 and 45 RPM. So that's gonna cover you for the modern 12-inch LPs, like the ones you see on the wall behind me, and the 7-inch singles. So overall, it really is a no-nonsense turntable. Now, as far as speakers go, you could pair the Orbit with either the Mica PB42Xs, or if you really want the best sound, you could go with those super sweet Klipsch R15PMs. I'm kind of a big fan of Klipsch, if you couldn't tell. And finally, number one, the Project Debut Carbon. I've saved the best for last because if you got the money, you really cannot beat the Project Debut Carbon. Year after year, it continues to get great reviews, and that's why I always recommend it and put it at the top of my lists, because it really is an excellent turntable. Now, the reason it's so good is because Project put a lot of thought into the design of this turntable. First off, it's called the Debut Carbon because its tone arm is actually made of carbon fiber and that alone has a big impact on its overall sound quality. And just like the Orbit, it's also a belt-driven turntable. So yet again, that's gonna cut down on the rumble from the platter. And the final icing on the cake comes from the fact that every debut carbon is shipped with an Ortofon 2M Red cartridge. And after upgrading to that exact same cartridge on my LP120, I can tell you that not only does it sound excellent, but it also tracks the grooves perfectly. So it's really cool that that amazing cartridge comes standard on every debut carbon. So overall, if you're looking for the absolute best sound for your records, nothing beats this turntable within its price range. Now, the debut carbon spins at 33 and 45 RPM, but it does not come with a built-in preamp. However, since you still need a pair of speakers, I would recommend pairing it with those Klipsch R15PMs, which have both the preamp and the amplifier built inside. So basically with just those two items, the carbon and the Klipsch speakers, your entire setup is complete and you can just kick back, put on a great record and enjoy the music. Now, do you guys agree with this list? Have you bought one of these lately? And if so, how do you like it? Let us all know down in the comments below. And if you love all things vinyl, be sure to hit this red subscribe button right here so you won't miss out on the new videos. And most importantly of all friends, have an awesome day and keep spinning that vinyl.